Hello, welcome to this Apacer instructional video. Today, the Apacer team will show you how to install an M.2 SSD on a motherboard. Before installation, be sure to observe the following precautions. Fully shut down and power off your system, and ground yourself by wearing the appropriate anti-static gloves, coat, and wrist straps. Don't remove the SSD from its bubble bag until it's time to install the SSD. When you're ready to remove the SSD from its packaging, do not touch the gold connectors. In some cases, your M.2 SSDs may arrive in a tray. No matter what the packaging, please be careful to avoid touching the gold contacts. Next, it's time to locate the M.2 socket on the system board. It's here. And the screw attaches to a pedestal here. Let's make sure we have the SSD the right way up. Look closely at the B key on the left and compare it to the M key on the right. The B key is six pins wide, but the M key is just five pins wide. Next, check the port on the motherboard. You should be able to find the slot on the right for the M key. Be sure it lines up with the M key on your SSD. Insert the module into the connector at a 30 degree angle. Press it firmly into the socket. The module will spring back to a 30 degree angle unless you hold it down. Hold the module by one side and press it down until contact is made with the screw pedestal. Use a screwdriver to tighten the screw and secure the module to the system board. Torque the screw to the specified value. Do not over torque the screw and be careful the screwdriver does not scratch the PCB or any other components. To remove it again, just perform the process in reverse. Unscrew it from the pedestal, hold it by the sides and remove it from the socket. And it's as simple as that. We hope this video helped you with the installation process. Thanks for choosing a pacer.